Well, hello everybody. Welcome back to another wonderful day of Charlotte Wars Adventure and Project Zomboid. And here we go. We're back for another go. I didn't want to record anything else or or, or edit anything because I'm a lazy ass. And so here we're gonna play some Project Zomboid. So let's check out the solo. I see you're affected quite recently. Do you want a tutorial before the inevitable occurs? No. Ah, okay, that's cool. Your first taste of zombie world. Life here is a little less harmful. Customize your very own zombie apocalypse. Survival. The full project zombie experience. Hardcore, not for the fate of heart. Survive for as long as you can in fearsome and unlikely circumstances. Really? That's interesting. Hmm. We were kind of doing first bite. But let's actually do something a little bit harder. Uh, dying just the way you want. Survival. Let's do survival. Let's just see what that's like. And we'll go from there. So they changed all of this. This is kind of neat. A very neat way of... Okay, and this is where we pick the towns probably, hey? So there's Moldra. Okay, I see, you see? So it looks like... I'm just kind of looking at the little map here. Just kind of trying to see if I can... See where we were before. I think these are those... Maybe we were up in one of these houses somewhere. I think one, of this one right here, and we went down these houses here. We went down here. This is the storage, I think. Okay, interesting. Well, let's press A on controllers in game to enable multiplayer split screen and spawn. Oh, that's cool. So that's a new thing they added. Select spawn location on map. Can we? Why well, would it be like click over here, or maybe I want to spawn in here? We'll do Moldra, and we'll go click in here, see if that's actually true. S the save name. Let's go YouTube. Since it's technically, you know, oh yeah, build 32, build 32. There we go. Uh, let's go next. Oh yes, we get to make our guy here. There's some customization aspect to the game now which is pretty cool this is another new addition all right you can have female or male looks like that's how you randomize it oh no no maybe not <laughs> okay so two different skin colors you can have i wish there was a random you generate maybe yeah so we can just keep generating names paul edwards that's what we'll call ourselves paul edwards okay so you can kind of have your facial hair you can have the colored top bottom um, hair type messy receding hair the Picard I wish you could zoom in on this so you can see it better bald spot how about we just go with none no hair whatsoever okay that'd be easy beard type let's have goatee let's go goatee and let's color it like that. Okay, perfect. Let's. Oh, here's the random button. Duh! I should have looked down at the bottom. <laughs> oh my goodness, peoples. That's so funny. Anyways, okay. So this is the the familiar occup occupation and traits. I'm just kind of gonna do a quick scan through here. I think there's some new stuff in here. Oh, blade maintenance, cooking. Uh, but then we have a minus four with this one. We got plus two with this guy. So we can actually go fast reader to read books. Or or take the out, outdoorsman. I think that would be... Uh, even wakeful needs less sleep. Look at that. Huh. Yeah, these are just little extra bonuses that, that you can have. Fitness instructor. Uh, but then we're at minus six, so we'll have to take these negative traits and slower running speed tire from running more easily lots of tiredness while sleeping or slow loss of tiredness that's interesting <laughs> illiterate cannot read books see that's pretty detrimental I think very detrimental would I have to do that yeah see I'd have to do that to to get rid of those. Okay, well, we're gonna do what we know. I 
think last time we chose the fire officer which gives us the fitness with the sprinting can we use less points no okay all right with the sprinting um, and so then we have oh actually zero points to spend now so they changed this you used to be able to have a couple points to spend okay that is interesting carpentry we have carpentry up already and then we have a plus two which means we can get you know like outdoorsmen or something and then that would give us a decent start this would be for building but let's check out some of these other ones and see repairman farmer farming okay that's interesting fishing foraging is that a new skill doctor veteran first aid light footed what's light footed huh I wonder what light footed is it doesn't say okay um, blade accuracy that's kind of cool better chopping trees faster axeman huh outdoorsman I don't know what to pick, everybody. Huh. Play maintenance, cooking, nutrition engineer. Because I kind of, I kind of want to build my own. Um, maybe we'll just do unemployed, fitness and strength, and then we can just add our own stuff. Maybe, maybe we can add fast reader. How about? Oh, is it because these other ones here probably? Stout, self defense, low thirst, keen hearing, hiker, plus one foraging, plus one trapping. Ah, okay. Plus two fitness, fast learner, fast healer, eagle eyed, brawler, light footed, and nimble. Hmm. Less prone to disease, slower rate of zombification. Lucky might sound like something interesting to choose. Just because I wonder if it gives you better loot when you when you open the container. So I think that's what it generates the loot. I'm not sure if it pre-generates or if it... Or whatever it does. Um, so why... So there's that sprinting stuff, right? Like, so for example... I know I'm taking a long time with this and I apologize, but... Say we pick fitness instructor. See, there's a sprinting skill, right? Well, where is that with this? Is that under here? S H L M N O P. No, see, I don't see sprinting in here. So it's interesting. So you think it just gives me the points, and then we figure it out on our own? Well, I guess we could do that. So transfers inventory items quickly. Better vision at night. I want the outdoorsman for sure. Um, you got four points, right? Maybe we'll just take the lucky and just go with this. We'll be unemployed. Are you gonna be a fast reader? Be an outdoorsman, so we're not affected by weather conditions, so we can explore in the rain. And yeah, let's have lucky and see what happens. And what's this file? Maybe we can kind of create ones and save them I'm not sure about this maybe they're gonna add modding into it maybe there's a way of loading your know, your different jobs but I guess we'll have to see about that and so otherwise let's go play okay here we go nine o'clock in the morning let's pause it so this is the guide that shows up when you start up and it allows you to basically read what the controls of the game are but we did the tutorial so we've already gone through this so this is the same old you know, old stuff right and so we can actually not show the guide okay so let's close this guy this is that info panel the health so for example let's see here see this is our skills so nothing's up no bonuses to anything okay 
I don't know, maybe this will be pretty good. We'll give this a shot. I want it on pause, actually. Don't want the time advancing. <laughs> okay, we got all this stuff. Uh, oh, look at this. This is the new crafting screen. That's pretty cool. Craft sheet rope. And what is this used for, the sheet rope? Now, if only we knew... See, why would I want to build a drawer? Do I need that for... Huh, we can stack logs. That's cool. So that's what the rope is used for. My buckets. Okay, bag of plaster powder. Okay, so this is starting to get actually... Spiked plank. I wonder if you can use it as a weapon. Okay, that's cool. Cooking. And there's like a favorite. Looks like this is... Uh, to favorite it probably, so you can then find it under favorite. Oh, look at this. See, this is what I wanted. Kind of like an in-game wiki, you know? Like, I don't know. I don't know why you'd want to not use this. Look at that. You can make jar of stuff. That's cool. So, like, as you grow it, uh, eggplants, jar leeks. Yeah, see, that's cool. That's some new stuff. Open can beans. That's where you need can openers. <laughs> that's cool. Uh, this is so cool. Under health, this is where you can get bandages. Okay, cool. This, you can clean them. Disinfect. Cool. Douse cotton. And, ah, look at that. So, cotton balls are useful. We'll have to take those. We'll have to remember to take those. Alcohol. Oh, wait. Bottle of disinfectant. Okay, so um, it's probably not specific. Uh, man, this is amazing. Campfire kit. Oh, look at that. Stone hammer, stone axe. You can even start... Oh, wow. Okay. Make a tent kit. That's cool. We're definitely going to have to kind of see if we can survive in the wilderness as well. Oh, we can dismantle things? Huh. Earbuds, screwdriver, digital watch, headphones, home alarm. Okay, this is cool. Huh. And then this is basically you're creating seeds. Put tomato seeds in packet. Put broccoli seeds. Okay. That's cool. Okay. Well, let's go back to general. Let's see here. We can have flashlight. Gather gunpowder so we can probably take apart ammo. Okay, that's kind of cool. We can make Molotov cocktails. We'll have to try that out. Uh, box of nails, box of paper clips. I'm not sure what the paper clips are for, but saw off shotgun. Okay, that's cool. Okay, well, okay, so this gives us a good start, gives us an idea, and let's close this and let's get on with the game. So here we go. So let's let's give it a shot and see how quick we die. Okay. Woo. There's a zombie, so we're gonna kind of sneak around here. Okay, let's see what we have for items. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna grab the items I know that don't, let's see, capacity eight. Let's equip our secondary. Um, actually, let's unequip. I don't know, we'll, 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 we'll see if we need that. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to basically look for a weapon. Spoon, tuna, banana. Let's kind of eat some food here. Let's grab one water bottle. Let's, do we need to, we can drink. Uh, okay. Door. Okay, is this a lootable object? No. Okay, let's kind of sneak by here. Okay, don't see anything here. Farming for uh, intermediates, that's cool, that's cool. We gotta be careful with our weight because we can't have too much. Hopefully, there's nobody up here. Just using right click. 
Ooh, look at this. Look at this. There's actually a few books here. Carpentry Master, Carpentry. Cool. And I don't even know if we're going to start in this house. So, uh, I don't know what to do. Okay, let's see here. Okay, I don't, don't want to do that. It gets kind of beta blockers. Those are cool. So maybe what we'll do is maybe we need... Oh, there's no weapons. Okay, that sucks. Yeah, maybe what we'll do is we'll leave... We'll keep the carpentry for beginners, but all these other ones we don't need. Uh, the water bottle we need. Let's see here. Let's, is there anything in here? Okay, no. Anything in here? Just underwear. <laughs> uh... How about in here? No zombies? Okay, that sucks. So we're going to have to kind of probably go crawling around a bit. Let's see here. No, nothing in here. Okay. So there was a zombie out there. So let's see if we can go out here. Okay, there's a couple there. Let's go up this way. Oh, there's a bunch there. Bunch there. Okay, but there's a house there, so we want to go... Oh, shoot. Now, can we process things off the trees? No, I don't know how to grab, like, bushes and stuff. and Like, the twigs. How do you get the twigs? Do you need a tool for that? Uh, it's kind of... Okay, so let's check this out. Let's push E, alright. I'm on. Maybe. Okay, let's try a different window. We're, f we're screwed if there's an alarm, so. <laughs> but, you know, if you. Okay, that's good. Let's see. Okay, perfect. Perfect. So if you haven't grabbed your tasty treats or or your drink, I would I would recommend you go ahead and do that. Uh, just because I don't know, I would say go ahead and do that. Grab your tasty treats and your drink. Come back, sit down, pause or unpause, and yeah. So we're gonna actually equip this pool cue for now. So that way we have something to work with. Now I hear banging. I don't know if that's because there's zombies. Uh, perfume, toothpaste. Eat all apples. Eat all beef jerky. Eat all tofu. Well fed, okay. Gardening spray can. Oh, that's cool. We should grab that just in case. I haven't seen that. These packets are super light. We need a bag though. So, is there a frying pan? Uh, that, oh, there's hammers here. Gardening. Oh, there's another gardening spray. Okay. We don't need to. Maybe we're going to go into this house. Maybe we'll clear out the zombies around here. And maybe we'll use this place to start out and has enough grub around. Uh, here, well, this is a frying pan. I think this... Oh, this doesn't do as much damage. Okay. So maybe the pool cube would be better. Huh. Okay. Oh. I just want to make sure that we have that. Whoa! 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 E! E! Ah! Ah! <laughs> ah! Oh man, that was crazy. <laughs> Where's the other guy? Yo, hurry, dummy. Okay, this is pretty cool. Oh no, he's not dead. Now he's dead. Oh man, this is awesome. So they were knocking. Oh, no, the door's right here. There we go. Okay, let's check up here. Zombies. Okay, no, let's check up here. Oh, hello! 
I think once you see those particles, yeah, they're sh they're gone. Tote bag, um, capacity of eight. Might have to carry these crappy tote bags, but we'll see. We'll see. I don't want to, but okay. No, nothing. Okay. Uh, Okay, uh, cohesive cotton balls, sheets. So maybe what we can do is we're going to grab these sheets here. Is there any, is this? Oh, okay. This is actually a pretty decent bedroom. Maybe this will be my main bedroom. Uh, closed curtains. Okay. Oh, look, look. There we go. Put it on your back, school bag. Here we go. Okay, so let's put this stuff. Um, we don't need that. Let's put this with this frying pan. That and that. Um, these we can drag into our inventory there. And the tote bag we will put there. Okay, perfect. So here we go. Man, that was crazy. Okay, so I think this house is cleared. So let us do a quick sweep around on the outside here. Well, actually, we need to make sure that we got these. So we got closed window, and then we got closed curtains. Same thing here. We got closed window, or closed curtains. This one here would be... I think we have to grab one of these sheets, so we'll have to unpack these sheets. And I think once that is done, we can right click on this and go add sheet. Here we go. And then we can go close curtains. Perfect. Now the reason I'm doing this, can I add sheet to this? No, it's just a door. That's fine. It's that way the zombies don't see you. Not that that's an issue, but I have seen it in the game, and I have seen it kind of in operate. Oh no, I, I have seen it, but I haven't. I don't know. I guess we'll see what happens. So let's check out here. This might be a nice kind of place to start at. Well, maybe, maybe. Can we go map? No, we can't go map. Oh, I hit Q by accident. That's okay. Come on, there we go. There we go, okay. Uh, no, nothing on that one. Now I'm overheating, so let's unequip the vest. And let's unequip the pants. <laughs> okay, let's put that in there. Pool cue is still doing good for condition. Um, I'm pleasantly hot, okay. Let's kind of do a quick. There's a group of zombies there. There's a dead zombie for some reason. I wonder why. There's some zombies there. Okay, so I see. Looks like there's more zombies with the difficulty. Huh. That is interesting, actually. Very interesting. And it's coming into the evening here. So, what we're going to do is we're actually going to run back to this house here. Maybe it is in that area that I clicked on. I don't know. There's a couple zombies here. Let's go take them out. Ooh, what the heck? What's going on here? Ah! I'm gonna die! I'm gonna die! Ah! Ah! Huh. Wow, I wanted to check that house out, but let's see if we swing around the house here. Uh, did we get damaged at all? Uh, slight damage, okay, but I don't think we're bleeding or anything yet. Come on! 
That was a crazy guy. How was my health now? Very minor damage. Might have to make a bandage. If that's even possible. Where did those two zombies go? Anyways. Oh! Ah, come on! Where did the zombies come from? Why are they in there? Minor bleeding. Oh, great. So, we need to run back. Uh, I might die, guys. That's hilarious. Okay, that's... Minor pain. Okay, that's no good. Um, okay, where's... Come on, come on. Okay, where's inventory? He's a bandages. Right click. Apply bandage to right hand. But minor injuries. First aid required. What's going on now? Bandaged. Minor pain. Minor damage. How do you do first aid, peoples? Rip sheets. One all. Huh. Bath towel. Now we're peckish. First aid. Okay, so how do we do this now? Do we fill a water ball? Okay, so let's remove bandage right hand. Oh, so I'm right clicking on this. Okay, I haven't actually done the first aid stuff. Deep wound bleeding, large glass shards. Oh, do I need to actually take that out, you think? So, so crawling through the broken... Oh man, I might die, everyone. That's hilarious. Okay, where's the dirty... Where's the dirty thing? Now it's infected. Uh, oh, that's no good. That's no good. How about if we rip sheets on... Okay, and how about apply bandage right hand? Okay, so does that pause everything or will that heal it slowly? So we need to find. Now it's dirty, so I think I'm gonna die. Yeah, I think I'm going to die. Ah, uh, this sucks. So first, first go, you know, first episode. <laughs> We're gonna have death. Oh man, that sucks. So don't go crawling through broken windows. Yeah, look at that, it's bleeding again. Well, if that's the case, I'm gonna go out hardcore then. Zombies, where are you? Because we can. We can rem well. Maybe what we'll do. Oh shit! There's a big group there. Hey, dudes. Oh. Okay. Let's try this this way. Probably the pool cue sucks. Ah, uh, I'm gonna die. Ah. Uh, okay, run. Uh, do we have the frying pan? Yeah, let's go equip primary. Okay. Um, there we go. Now let's see what happens. Yeah, see, more hardy. There we go. That took care of them. Okay. I want to go into that house that we've got clear here. Let's 
see there's an alarm in here. There we go. An alarm? Anybody in here? Nothing in here? It's a room to die in. It's a die in the corner. Oh shit. Oh, come on. There's a lot of you guys. Come on. There they are. Come on. Oh, come on. Let's run. There we go. Yeah, this is way harder than I expected. Way harder. Way harder. Now I'm going to die. I'm scratched. I'm bitten. Oh, well. Okay, so... <laughs> The skill level I picked is definitely not the one for me to pick to have a pleasurable playthrough. Uh, uh, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die. Okay, well there you go everybody. This is it. Well, thank you everybody for watching. I appreciate you watching this episode. Next time we're gonna start all over and I don't know, we're gonna, you pick the the first bite one, the the easier one, because we're fucking screwed. So, yeah, so thank you everybody for watching. Hopefully you've enjoyed this episode. So, either A, they made the game harder, because the survival mode, I don't know, I think I picked that one before, but maybe the beginner mode is the first bitten one, or the first bite or whatever, so maybe we'll give that one a shot instead. Uh, but this one's definitely a challenge. It definitely got the heart pumping in a couple places. Yeah, man, I'm glad I chose this game to play today. So yeah, so thanks for watching, and I look forward to seeing you in the next episode. Bye-bye.